I like the shine on the surface I like the feel of the skin Just for this time I won't question Or wonder what else might have been Foundation, it's a sail training organisation. Um, it's been around for the last 21 years. Its prime purpose is to offer young people the opportunity to sail on a tall ship and experience things that they would never experience anywhere else in any other activity. Lewin is the only square rig ship in Western Australia. It's certainly uh, the biggest sail training ship in, in Australia. It's a youth adventure scheme. We take the youth of all ages. But if it's somebody in their 80s is keen to come, we're very keen for them to be involved because almost invariably they've got something to offer. Normal voyage starts here in Fremantle or in any port in fact. We welcome people on board, they start they usually a little bit dazzled because not many people are used to uh, being on a ship. You start out by doing a lot of training, learning some of the basics, how to handle lines, how to brace the yards. You learn all the lines, all the ropes you learn about raising the sails, lowering them about how to, you know, steer the ship, navigate, how to tack, how to climb aloft safely and uh, if you're down in the galley then you get to learn how to cook. Slowly they begin to get to know each other, there's games and icebreakers which allow them to know each other and then ultimately that happens over the whole world which is our four watches. Over the rest of the week, then the rest of the few days, uh, they become a little bit more confident. We give them a little bit more uh, technical tasks to do, if you like. Every aspect of the ship, uh, they learn how to do. So it's from cleaning it, to sailing it, to steering it, um, everything. They learn everything about the ship. On Eco Voyages, we do a lot more sort of conservation activities on shore. Uh, we do a lot of hikes, educational hikes, and um, uh, experiencing the nature that we're, we're travelling through. Um, but sort of is all part of being part of the team on board the ship. Skating away on the surface Chasing the thrill of the wind The best experience is probably making all the new friends. There's just so many characters or just find people from all over the place. The experience on the loon was climbing to the top of the main sail. After some time I got up the rigging and um, I was a bit shaky up there but I managed to pull in some sail, pack it in, tie a few knots and furl the sail and I was quite proud of myself. Well I overcame my fear of heights and that was really good. Part of my experience um, I'd either be driving the boat through decent swells when everyone was getting saturated up on the bow. That was good fun. I've actually learnt to sit back and listen to other people first. One thing I've learnt from this experience is that I should always push myself because yeah, I surprise myself sometimes, which is rather good. Today I am the shine on the surface. Today I am the feel of the skin. Many people that come on board have never been out of sight of land. So at, at every level, socially and environmentally, they're out of their comfort zone. People realise they may not be from the same walk of life, they may not have the same interests or the same backgrounds, but they're working together for a common goal. Um, and it really is quite dynamic when you get the mixed voyages of, of older participants and youth come together and, and there is this great support network. Uh, everyone is different, everyone comes on at a different stage in their life and everyone steps off in a different stage. Skating away on the surface. It's a personal thing that individually they um, have conquered fears. Um, the fear of height, the fear of the sea, the fear of being seasick. And that achievement, I think, is, uh, gives them enormous confidence. Give me one! Give me two! Give me three! Give me four! Five! Break down! Eee-haw! <laughs>
I wanted to meet a lot of people as well, and I met some wonderful people. I made so many friends. The people that I went with are just fantastic, and the watch leaders are so friendly, and the cook, she's awesome, she makes the best food, and everyone's just great. I made so many friends, friends for life. I had a great time. All the kids were very nice to me, and I think age doesn't really matter. If you're young at heart, well, yes, it's, it's good. I am the warmth and the sweetness that surrounds everything. I think Lewin really allows you to dream, to think big and to realise that you are capable of doing anything you set your mind to. It really is an amazing experience that if I could give to every single youth in the world, I certainly would. You don't walk away from Lewin the same person and ultimately your life has changed from here on, here on in. You're a Lewinite, you're part of the family and uh, the vast majority want to come back and, and relive that and form new friendships and challenge themselves and keep on learning. I think that's the beauty of Lewin is as a volunteer you get to come back and provide that experience for someone else because you know what it meant to you and where it took you in your life and to be able to give that to someone else is such a great gift and so Lewin is just a, a special place where uh, dreams come true I suppose. That's Good times. It's a fabulous adventure. It's life changing. <laughs>